SVB Financial Group, NASDAQ, SIVB, New Stock Analysis Market. ISIN, US 78486Q1013. SVB Financial Group, NASDAQ, SIVB, has been a leading bank for technology companies and startups for nearly four decades. Since 1983, when Silicon Valley Bank was founded, it has specialized in serving and lending to companies that many other traditional banks have found it too risky to cooperate with. But with its roots in the U.S. Technology and Innovation Center, SVB has grown as a bank for the emerging tech industry. Today it is one of the leaders in providing financial services to the innovation economy, including startups and more mature companies. In addition to Silicon Valley Bank, SVB Financial also manages SVB Private, its private banking and asset management business, the investment bank arm SVB Securities and SVB Capital, its private equity business. Together, SVB wants to be the financial partner for innovation and growth companies, from startups to post-IPO and beyond. Business has been going very well in recent years. Since 2017, SVB has increased its total assets by 393% and earnings per share by 303%. Although much of its growth was due to organic expansion, SVB also used acquisitions to launch new ventures. In 2018 it acquired Lear Inc., strengthening its investment banking business in healthcare and life sciences. In 2020 it acquired West River Group to restart its SVB Capital Credit platform. In 2021, it acquired Boston Private, a $900 million move to significantly increase its private banking offerings. Finally, it remains a growing business. Not only is there a significant opportunity to continue growing with its existing customers as they mature, but it constantly adds new customers. SVB added approximately 1,700 new business customers in the first quarter and recorded an average growth of 9% in new business customers since 2018. At the command, Greg Becker became CEO of SVB in 2011 and has been with the company for nearly 30 years. That means it helped guide the company through the dot-com bubble, the global financial crisis, and the coronavirus pandemic. This is a wealth of experience in very diverse environments that has been useful to him and shareholders during his tenure. At 54, Becker is still relatively young, which makes it more likely that we can count on his continued leadership in the years to come. Becker has a very small stake in the company. What makes SVB Financial a good investment? SVB Financial, like many of its most successful clients, has matured as a company. It is well managed, diversified and financially strong. Yet it is still incredibly well positioned to serve the innovation economy as the preferred financial services partner. Thousands of startups, backed by VC, private equity, and even pre-VCs, Choose it as the bank of choice. Based on earnings, it is more interesting, trading 16 times in the queue and 12.5 times ahead of earnings estimates. Put it all together and SVB Financial is a great company that is well managed, in solid financial condition and continues to grow rapidly. We are happy to add this company to our recommendations. Financial data. In fiscal year 2021, SVB's revenue increased by 52.25% compared to the year 2020. Net income increased by 51.74%. Risks At its core, SVB Financial is a bank. And that means it is affected to some extent by cyclical economic changes that can affect commercial banks. Any slowdown in risk financing could affect the parts of its business that depend both directly and indirectly on these funding cycles. If the market environment and slowdown worsen, fewer technology and highly innovative companies may seek to sell or acquire other companies. It is likely that SVB Financial will see a slowdown in its business, hurting high margin earnings growth. Finally, there is the potential harm of execution risk. As a lender, capital provider and investment manager, if SVB's loan and investment portfolios do not function as expected, losses may occur. Who is this title recommended for? This stock could be interesting for investors looking for growth and exposure to financial and banking services. For those who do not also own SVB Financial Group in their portfolio and for those who do not care about greater volatility of certain securities, even financial ones that are generally considered less risky. 
It may not be suitable for investors looking for dividends or stocks with lower volatility, those who already own some financial companies or banks, and investors who already own more than 1% or 2% of SVB Financial in their portfolios. Conclusion SVB Financial has been a great investment for many years. Since Greg Becker became CEO in 2011, he has more than doubled the S&P 500's returns, an increase of 719%. But I think his future remains very bright. Whether commercial or investment banks, private banking or capital markets, founders and lenders of innovative companies can count on it for all their financial needs.